starting the car won't be so simple for those with DUIs anymore. In Missouri, those convicted of drinking and driving will now face a harsher penalty. The state of Missouri passed a new bill, Senate Bill 480, which changes the consequences of drinking and driving. Starting in fall of next year, people who accumulate multiple DWI convictions will be required to put an ignition interlock device in their car, and they will have to keep it for six months. And if they blow positive into the machine or if they tamper with it, they then will have to keep it for an additional six months. Right now, people convicted of their first DWI have a 90-day suspension of their driver's license. And after 30 days of no driving, they can then get a restricted license. But when the new law kicks in, drivers will no longer have to wait 30 days if you agree to have an ignition interlock device installed in your car. In that case, you can then begin driving after only 15 days. Uh, but the law change allows it's only a 15-day hard walk, meaning that uh, only for the first 15 days of that 90-day suspension, you can't drive at all. But then after, after that, as long as you have the ignition interlock installed and meet the other requirements, you would then be, then be able to drive for the rest of that 90-day suspension. These changes will go into effect on October 1st of 2013. Monisha Bruner, KTVO News.